To use the Gallagher SMS Energizer controller, you will need a GSM SIM card and an install location with sufficient network coverage. For a list of providers that can be used, contact your local Gallagher rep. Install the SIM card and make sure you have a working network connection before going out on site. Step 1 is to open the SMS Energizer controller using a Phillips head screwdriver. You can then insert the SIM card underneath the battery holder and remove the battery tab. Now you can replace the cover back on the unit. Apply power using the mains adapter provided and switch the unit on by sliding the magnetic switch to the on position. The light will flash on and off a few times. When it stays solid green for 5 to 10 seconds, it means you now have a successful network connection. Register your phone with the SMS Energizer controller by sending the text message REG, R-E-G, to the phone number associated with the SIM card inside the SMS Energizer controller. Within a minute, you should have a response telling you your phone number is registered. You can confirm the registration is successful by sending a second text from your phone with simply an I for inquire. The response will say that the Energizer has a mains power failure of course it will, we haven't connected the Energizer yet. After checking your phone is registered successfully, turn the SMS Energizer controller off to prevent the batteries from going flat. Now for installing on site with an Energizer, using the screws provided in the box, screw the back cover onto the wall. Put the front cover on and screw it into place. Then connect the RJ cable with one end plugged into the back of the Energizer. There are two sockets for this under the SMS Energizer controller. It doesn't matter which one you plug it into. Now you can insert the mains power adapter. And then insert the Energizer controller RJ cable into the remaining socket. The controller allows Energizer information to be shown in a more accessible location. It is even IP67 waterproof, so it can be installed on the outside of your shed. Extension cables are available for the Energizer controller, allowing for it to be placed up to 50 meters away.